Greetings and salutations everyone, my name is Samarno, welcome back to Samarno Plays, part one of Black Rose. I don't really know how long this game is, so I don't even know if it's actually going to have more than one part. But uh, it was a free game on Steam, so I figured I would play it for you guys. Um, I've heard mixed reactions on this game. I, uh, I like to go into games blindly, so I don't really know much about it other than the storyline, which... You know, I guess I could pull up the store page and read it to you, you know, for something to do. Uh, equipped with a flashlight, investigate an abandoned funeral home that's said to be haunted. Find out what really happened to the people who once worked there, and hope that this dark, eerie building doesn't become your final resting place. How was that? Was that good? No. <laughs> I know it's terrible. Uh, I have a new light. Right now that I have plugged in, uh, it was it's getting really dark here in Alaska, and it was even with uh, without my two main lights on, you couldn't see me, and that was gonna give me a bad headache. So I'm trying this one out. Also puts that spooky aesthetic up here. Blah! Uh, yeah. Okay, let's just get in this stupid game. Attention! This game contains flashing lights, quick time events, and jump scares. That sounds awful. Can't wait. Let's see here how to play. Your score will be based on close calls. Oh yeah, this game's got a score system, and I don't know why you would care about that at all. Uh, as a shift to run, move the mouse, left click to interact, pause. I had to pause. That's weird. So I've heard this game has. Um, has a problem with pulling you back really far if you die and fail. So, uh, I'm thinking I might not record those sections if they happen, you know, at least near the end of an episode. Just to save you guys time. Yeah, you can't wait. Timed mode. In this mode, you're being timed on how quickly you finish the game. Uh, score based on close calls. This mode does not focus on the story of Black Rose. Uh, no, we're obviously doing story mode then. In this mode, you follow the investigations of a mortician who worked at a funeral home many years ago before an unknown disaster killed all the employees. Excuse me. Unlike time mode, this mode focuses on the story of Black Rose and therefore much longer. Your final score will be based on your close calls only, as you are not being timed. This mode features a checkpoint system and will remember your previous checkpoint even if the game has been closed. Note, please do not close the game while you see the saving message in the bottom left hand corner of the screen. Literally, like every other game. That's a pretty interesting sound, actually. I feel like I've heard it somewhere. Like an AT&T commercial or something. T-Mobile! Uh... Okay. Mouse is a little sensitive. Wait. What are we in a foyer? Why is there doors like literally? Oh, okay. A little janky, maybe. Restricted area. Oh, fine. In the whole area, like restricted, you would think. Ooh, the sensitivity is a little crazier. Oh, well, why? I always check underneath struggles. Okay. Is someone else here? No. Of course not. I'm already so lost. Map? No, of course not. Wait. Oh. So that just goes all the way around. Okay. Why does this exist? Oh, here we go. Boss says not to go near Myrtle's coffin. 
Why won't the gravedigger bury it anyway? It's not like what boss says is true. I mean, the dead can't really talk, can they? Well, maybe they can. Technically they can, because they have that dull, uh, you know, whisper thing. So, effectively, air is, it can escape through the body as you, like, compress, and so it makes it sound like you're saying something when you're dead, when you're not actually. I do not see the point of this balcony. This seems like an awful idea. Because isn't that the funeral down there? It's jammed. Um, but I might need to full I might be able to force it open. I need to ram it a couple times. Okay. Ooh, I like that effect. There we go. Wait, where is it? There it is. There's a baby monitor here. Strange. Yeah, that is strange, actually. That's really, really strange. Why would you ever have one of those in a place like this? <sighs> Alright. I'm guessing it goes off when there's people around. Or ghosts. Ghosts are still people. Kind of. Ha! <laughs> <laughs> oh... That was good voice acting. <laughs> Come downstairs. Who's that? Uh, <laughs> no thanks. Why does this room exist? This door is warped pretty badly. I don't think I'll be able to get it open. Oh, I was hoping I could still ram it and see. Family room. Do do do. Oh, let's try down here. Yeah. Shit. All right. Hello. Okay. Oof. This hasn't been that way yet. This hasn't been a lot of ways. Oh my god. Okay. Wait, did that throw open before? It didn't. And this sort of didn't either. I guess they were pretty serious about keeping this door shut. I wonder if the keys are around here somewhere. Probably right through here. This is an awful, awful wallpaper. Probably a fabric motif, actually. Ugh. Why is this a thing? around so we this way. What the hell? Does this legitimately just wrap around? No, I guess not entirely. Hmm. Alright, whatever.
her eyes. Do not, don't look her in the eyes. Alright. So, like, what? Like, Slenderman or. The other baby monitor is down here. This is weird. I'm not sure I want to be here anymore. Something feels wrong. Of course it does. You're in an abandoned funeral home, you jackass. B and E, brother. Oh, for fuck's sake. Where are we at? All right, ghost. Don't look her in the eyes. You got it. We'll just look down, then. Nah. See ya. What's going on? Let me shut this door. There. Everything's good. Door shut. How is this door locked? I know it wasn't earlier. Ah, uh, fine. Wait. Shit. Wait. So what's my goal to uh escape? I guess she got me. <laughs> okay. Uh. So I guess we don't go into that room then, huh? Is this the very beginning? Pain and suffering has warped their bodies. Okay. That's fine. So the Uri. Yeah, I get it. Vengeful ghosts, if you will. Speak Speaking of which, um... I uh, I downloaded some more or bought I guess they are they are for sale on Steam. Um, I bought um, some other Chilla's art games. Like uh, they're the guys who did uh, the convenience store. That one gave me a good startle, so I think I figured I would buy a couple more when they were on sale recently, and I did. So. So expect to uh, see me play those games here probably shortly.
Well, it's funny the first time. That one didn't work last time. I went through all these doors before. Exactly where she is. I'm gonna try uh, looking down while I open the door. They get me for the damn thing. I was hoping that if I looked at my at the floor, she wouldn't be able to get me. Uh, we'll try one more time. So I'm wondering if I have to release her and then run away and try to open the door, maybe? What? Oh. Okay.
Don't care. No. Shoot. I thought that would work, but maybe I had to walk in here first. Ooh! See ya! Wait, where the fuck am I? See ya! I didn't see anything in this room worth anything. I don't know where the heck it wants me to go. I'm supposed to find keys. Game is so empty. Can I slam into it? No. Why not? So there really doesn't seem to be anything to do in this game. Unless the doors only unlock after you hit a certain score, maybe? In which case, that's annoying. Alright. 
I guess we gotta go back downstairs. I probably want to figure out how to do this, right? There's the stairs. Okay, good. So, if I got to juke this lady... Okay. I have no idea where the hell she is. Stairs over here. Yep. All right, we got this figured out. Yeah, we're good. Oh. Oh, I feel dumb. It's a shiny gold key in the coffin. Alright. Great. to go for this. Hey, lady! Wow, we tried. Ish. Uh, well, we kind of figured out what we were supposed to do. Um, I guess maybe I was supposed to go to the like the lower stair door. I was going to go all the way up to give myself enough, a little extra time and kind of bash through that but it didn't let me, so. Oh well. Um, I may return to this game at some point. I'm not sure. I haven't really decided. <laughs> um, but um, until then, I'll see you guys next time here on Smart Mario Plays. I'm definitely probably going to play something else <laughs> right now. Um, Alright, I'll see you then.